In this video, I'll show you how to work with the mentioned feed. Let's click the alert name in the sidebar to access the feed. Here we can see the short previews of all mentions collected. To display the full post or a web page, let's click on its preview. At the bottom of the preview, we'll see the toolbar. Here you can mark a mention as important by clicking on the star button. When you've finished working with a mention, click Done. This mention will be moved to the Done folder and won't get in your way while you're working on other mentions. You can display all starred or marked as done mentions in the corresponding folders. Awario analyzes text of a mention and automatically defines its sentiment, which can be positive, negative, or neutral. To change sentiment manually, we can click on the sentiment button in the preview and select the right option. To tag a mention, let's click the corresponding button, enter its name, and then save. We can use the advanced filters to display all mentions with certain sentiment or tags. Let's open the filters, select the necessary options, and then apply the filter. If we found a mention from the author or domain that's irrelevant to us, we can add it to the blacklist. To do so, let's click the blacklist button. All mentions from this author will be removed from the feed. Awaria won't search for any mentions of this author or domain. We can view or edit the list of blacklisted entries in the alert settings. To delete a mention from the feed, let's use the corresponding button. We can comment, reply, share, or retweet mentions from social media as well as follow their authors. To do so, just connect the social media accounts and use the engagement buttons in the mention and author cards. The pro or enterprise users can export their mentions to the CSV format. To do so, let's click the export button and save the file. And that's how you work with the mention feed.